Well, another rainy day. I can't get out, so I'm trapped. I'm going to start taking this singer apart. This ain't hardly worth the effort, but plastic. There's a little bit of steel in here and Really? That's cast aluminum right there. So, hmm, there. There might be something in here. There might be something in here. A little bit of steel. Um, there's that part. Deal. Um. Are we recording? Yeah, I'm recording. That's the only thing I don't like about this camera being on my head. Because I forget whether I've got it. Recording or not. Sometimes. Now. That, my friends, is plastic. Um, which, yeah, that might take that loose. I spent a lot of time working on sewing machines because my shop. My furniture store and everything, we had, let's see, I probably had about 10 or 12 sewing machines, these were industrial machines, and um, out of them 10 or 12, I probably had 6 or 7 running, because that's how many seamstress I had, and they had to stay busy. Busy, I won't make no money. Um, all right, there's something here. Let's 
Let's see. cast aluminum now I think the uh, air here it goes plastic I like here in UK when he's scrapping steel plastic Aluminium. <laughs> I like my. All right, something's. What is holding that on there? Okay. If I look like I don't know what I'm doing, I probably don't. Now, yeah, well that Bob and Carrie here, yeah, there it comes out. More good high grade steel. But. Um, ouch, plastic, <laughs> plastic, oh there's a lot of, uh, yeah there's a good piece of cast aluminum in there, oh yeah, now suddenly, suddenly, Wait a minute, what the heck? What the heck? Let's see. Alright, now what's holding that on? There's the motor. That might be a good little motor. And that looks like cast aluminum. Sure enough. Alright, is this something that's holding something on there? It looks like it. What is that? Metal. Alright now. Come on, figure it out, Dauber. All right, there's nothing to take loose there. Okay, screw here. I'll 
I'll just keep taking screws loose till it just pops apart. And I need Shane, you keep pulling me. I'll lay the hatchet to you. And I'll guarantee you I'll get you off of there then. That won't come off. That won't come off. Anything under there? Nope. Um, you know what? Let me cut that little wire loose there. Now. got to be another screw here or there somewhere. There's a nice shoe chip. Alright, let's see here. Let me take that loose. the screw time working on my machines because most of the time when your commercial machines are running and something gets out of whack one of them a lot of times I could fix it myself but a lot of times too I had to call the uh, sewing machine mechanic and when them boogers come over there <laughs> it's so much an hour And that last mechanic I had, his name was George Wilder. But that's been many years ago. Alright. He 
you know, a lot of these parts on these things anymore is plastic. Steel. Okay, how do I... Okay, I gotta... Get that foot off of that. Like so. That's steel, good grade of steel. That's a good grade of steel. Now, uh, what's holding that needle bar in there is an Allen set screw. So, let me see. Let me see. Is it this size? No, that's not it. That's not it. Let me check this right quick. I'll be quick and find them T bars. think it's this one. No, that's too big. So it's got to be I want a dadgum roach. I'm going to have to spray again out here. You know what? These are these standards, yeah, the marks done rubbed off. That's going. All right. All right. How am I going to do this? Okay. I don't, I'm not set up in here yet. I keep starting to work on it, but then I wind up, then I wind up, uh, I don't want the green ones. Now, let's see. Got that one. Got that one. I'm gonna find one of them in there that'll work on this. This is standards, and I'm thinking well, that going. My fingernails are breaking all the crap. What does that mean? Does that mean? All right, that one's too big. And if this one here don't work, that means it's metric. Yep, it's metric. Bigger than doo doo. Bigger than doo doo. Alright. Not that, not that. Not that one. Could be that one, but I think it might be too big. What the heck? That's it. Okay. 
Yeah, I need I need another set of lights in here. I need to clean up and I keep saying that, I swear. I got intentions on doing it, but I just get so What the heck? What is that? Dad going. Coming on off of there. Just my patootie. What is that? Should slide right off of there. Now I ain't. Been that long, so long ago that I forgot. But that needle bar is supposed to slide right off of there with that set screw took out. And it's not sliding off of there. I want one of my punches in there. Probably not. I'm running around here like an amateur. Ah. Oh. Crap. Oh, right there's one that has to come off. Now, what do I do with that dang? <laughs> You're ignorant old man. There it is. Is that it or is that one, it's one smaller? Oh, it's smaller than that one. That kind of looks like it. Yeah, that's it. It's coming back. Yeah, I, you know. Oh. Uh, when we moved from Virginia to uh, why ain't that moving off of there? Well, that should come right off of there. All right. I got something better lock it out of there. I think. There it is. You see folks, some of this stuff I'll hang on to. Some of this high grade steel, uh, the cast stuff here I want, but this machine stuff, I will, because like I say, I have once while I'm working on projects and stuff, and uh, that's, all right, that's turning on there, so that should, that should be coming.
that should be coming right off of there. The set screws took out. That should slide out of there. And of course, uh, my grand, I'm gonna have to start putting my stuff under lock and key when I get everything straightened out because my grandson will come in here and what is that? Uh, that might work. Uh, that might work. There it comes. A little persuasion there. See, that's high, that's high grade steel too. So, a lot of this cast is just red. Now, will that come out? Uh, what have I got here now that needs to... Alright, this whole thing in here is, is cast uh, aluminum, so it's... It's, uh... You know, it's amazing. Uh, these machines, these sewing machines, they never cease to amaze me. I mean, they're so precision made that people take them for granted. Oh, but I need to keep these right there. I don't want to misplace them now. What do I want to do? Um, there's the dog feed. I don't particularly need that off right now, but I need to, I may have to take the hatchet to this thing. I hate to take, you know, when I have to take a hatchet to something to finish getting it apart, it's kind of like defeat. <sighs> There's something holding that dad gone to thing on and I, can't figure out what the Sam Hill is holding it. It's something down here. It's something down here. Uh, I can take them loose. Oh, and I can take that loose. There's, there's some more high grade steel in here. Them's going to be stubborn. I want that motor. But now what the heck is holding? Yeah, I want that motor. And that belt. Sam Hill is holding that on. I reckon I'm uh, let me get the hammer on it. Dad's gonna uh, yeah when you have to Dad gone magnets laying everywhere they stick on to everything. It's it's admitting defeat. It's it's outsmarted you when you have to take a hammer or a hatchet to it because you can't figure out how to get it loose. Now something, what the Sam Hill, you know what, I ain't going to let this whoop me, Dad's going to, I'm going to figure you out, you little devil. I'm going to figure you out. Now what the heck? something okay GoPro turn I, I I need to clean my bench up a little here because I'm gonna start knocking Allen wrenches off in the floor and these other parts I need to clean bench before I lose something so GoPro turn off I mean go I mean shoot uh 
is it recording yeah no yeah it's recording so say you got to tell it to stop uh, recording instead of just saying turn up because it won't turn off till you got it stopped from recording so gopro stop recording gopro stop recording okay I really hate to say this thing's whooping me, but you know what? It might whoop me in this little battle about why I can't get them all. But it ain't gonna win the war because I couldn't find my half. I bet that baby's. I bet that baby took it outside again. Something is keeping that. You ain't gonna win, Mr. Singer. I'll guarantee you, you ain't gonna win. I will. Oh, right there's a screw I didn't see. I don't think I. Okay. There, that part come off. Well, that that's part of the battle. Now that was part of it. Um. Trouble is, these are some funky. That one ain't wanting to come off. That one ain't wanting to come off. Let's see about this. That's coming off. That's coming off. But that ain't going to... And that's... Stripping out, so... How am I supposed to get these? You ain't going to win, Mr. Singer. I'm going to win. I need... All right. Let's see a battle. Told you so, Mr. Singer. You ain't whooping my butt. But you know, that's a nice little piece of aluminum. Holy crap. Yeah, that's a... That is a nice piece of aluminum. But now i got to figure out why Handle out of the way. 
fire. Uh, you know what? Let me. Maybe I need a different. Hmm. Maybe I need a different. I ain't never seen Phillips heads like that. Maybe a flathead would work better. No, it's not a flathead. Not a flathead. GoPro, I'm going to use my other camera that shows me in this stuff. I just like this GoPro because it sees everything I see. And I like that. But there again, I forget whether I'm recording or not recording. I can't see it. Yeah, folks, that's a, that's a nice piece of aluminum right there. It surely is. I'll have to remember that now, because I wasn't expecting that much out of this thing until I seen that piece of aluminum. somewhere it gave reasons why old people have more gas and have these slips <laughs> I read the reason for it but I can't remember what it was well come on my back ain't in hold Alright, got it. 
Oh. I gotta sit. Well, let me get this one. A lot of screws, folks. A lot of screws. Oh, gotta sit down again. I definitely want that motor. Now, there's one more screw holding this thing somewhere. And if I can... What is holding it? It's not there. It's not there. It's right down in here somewhere. Come on now, what hole man? Well, folks, that's a blooming mystery to me. And I'll guarantee you when I find that one screw that's holding that, it's going to be so obvious. What in the world? By gosh, there's something. And it's holding it right in here. Alright, let me look at this logically again. Just don't. You know what? All right, there's one big screw right there, but whether I can, we'll see. Oh, I need a bigger screwdriver. That's not it. That's not it. And why, of course, it's not here. I think this is going to have to be it. got a magnet on it too for some reason. Put that over there. What in the world? Maybe. I don't see no screw in that. There's 
to screw in that but I don't see where that would hold This cover You know I could cheat and saw it off But I won't figure it out I want to figure it out What the Sam Hill Is holding that folks It's whipping my butt That's not fashion to that. Come on. It's right here. It's something. It's right in here. It's right. It is right in there somewhere. Well, shoot. Folks, I'm gonna have to cheat. Dad, don't it? I hate that let that thing whoop me. Now, what is holding that? It's right in here. Well, change blade on that thing too so let me do that for a start oh lordy 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 i need a blade and i hope i got some hanging yeah i got some hanging over here oh, oh lord I gotta get my think this is the one. Yeah, that's the one. You know, some of these things are 
What the hell is that? I hope I ain't out of them blades. Surely I'm not. Oh, there's one more. Well, I got one more. I thought I had more than that, to tell you the truth. There it is. There it is. You know, sooner or later, if I don't get this mess cleaned up in here, I am going to trip on something and fall. If I don't get it cleaned up. Okay, I hate giving up like this, but you know, I gotta be sensible. It's, it's whooping me. <laughs> it's whooping, where's my dad gone? I don't even see my pickup stick now. I gotta bend down there and get it. <laughs> okay. I hate smell that plastic burning. Alright, there comes part of it now. You know what? That son of a bitch still ain't. I don't mean to be cussing, folks, but I'm getting mad. That don't it. It was holding it over here. Why ain't that? 
it. My patootie. Dang. Don't make no sense. What is hope? Let me look, see if I can see anything in there. Turn it down this way. Okay. on that part. Flash! Okay. What is holding that for crying out loud? See what was holding there's that screw right there. And of course, see that screw? That stuck way. I could well yeah I could. I could have got to it through that hole right there. Yep. Um, well now I know. Plastic. Fellas, that's pretty good. That's a good chunk of aluminum. <sighs> but it sure whipped my butt. I mean, it whipped my butt. That screw right there was not in plain sight. You had to go through a hole back there with a long screwdriver to get to that thing. And, and to start with, you had to know it was there. You had to know it was there. Now, if I ever come across another one of these, gosh, that's a nice piece of aluminum. Yep, you had to know that sucker was there. Get out of there, you sucker. Son of a gun. What about that? Learn something every day. Well, I've won. But what I feel like I've lost. Whew. Man, that wore me out. You know what, I should have took a picture of this darn thing before GoPro stopped recording. You know what, this, this is a, yeah this is my, this little motor in here, it's a keeper. It's a keeper buddy cause uh, come on, how come? I can't, I have got to make me an appointment to the eye doctor. Alright, let's get that out of there.
You know what, folks? As aggravating as this thing has been, I had a ball. <laughs> I, I did. I, 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 why the heck do I enjoy stuff like this? I don't know. I have, it was fun. <laughs> it was fun. I didn't think so at the time, but it's fun. I love taking stuff apart like this. And, of course, I know pretty much know how sewing machines work, but these little domestics, they're really a I can work on a commercial machine somewhat. Now, now I might. Yeah, this is a sewing machine motor, motor eight, bing, blah blah blah, one hundred and ten, one twenty. Does it have a reverse? Uh. No, but that is a nice, that's a nice little motor, and people, some of you scrappers, well, you gotta like it, but there's a bunch of them out there right now that just throw that in scrap, but not me, buddy, that's going on the shelf, and you know what else? I could probably I can make a switch and it'd be easy to mount to something for me to use because see that 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 thing's is it air cool? yeah it's air cool yep it's air cool so let's see what what is the it's 0.62 amps 50 60 8z whatever that means and it is a wow <laughs> that is fast 5000 rpms and it's got a thermal cut off on it that's a neat little motor That it. That's a bonus, folks. Love that stuff. That's going on the shelf. And I've already got something in mind for that. Sure do. Um. Now. I think it's looking pretty dark out there. It's not that late, but it's 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 um. Uh, gonna come a storm and I don't want to be out here in it. and my baby in there my 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 um 10 year old and he is my baby he if the lights flicker or something he freaks out he freaks out okay let me take take this front plate off because I'm going to have to completely strip this uh, piece of aluminum to um, cause that scrapyard I go to when I go is TMR and I know they're one of the big ones but I hate them suckers with a passion the company. I don't hate the guys. The guys just in there doing their job, but but there's one guy in there. He really got over on me one time. I forget how many pounds of brass it was, or it it was brass couplers. And I'll have to show you one day. Well, I won't even discuss it right now. It just irritates me. 
he got me for about a hundred dollars. He got me for about a hundred dollars. Well, I wonder about you. Yeah, that worked. Yeah, I need to get inside. I hear some. I hear some rumbling back there. <laughs> yeah, that's a nice. That's a nice piece of aluminum. That whole thing's got. Come look. Uh, I don't want to stop. You know. Hmm. Let me turn it up here. Come on, Russell. You got. You, uh, I got a quip. Oh, my grandson in there freaking out. He'll be 11 years old next month. <sighs> and. Oh, crap. There come the rain. Dad, don't it? I've studied too long. <laughs> oh, shit. I got this story I want to tell. It's going to make somebody, some people in the family mad. Especially my half brothers. Same mama, but different daddies. And uh, all goes back to when my mother abandoned me, my sister that was a year younger than me, and my brother that was three years younger than me. The other two brothers she took with them, but she dumped us on the side of the road out in front of my grandma Pearson's house. And that, we had a little brown bag of clothes that we was taking with us and she took off with her boyfriend she left my daddy that night that was mother's day 1951 oh boy and um at the time i didn't feel too traumatized by it But, I guess I was. Anyway, that's another video. I ain't going to talk about it no more. Oh my God, I waited too long. It's got to quit now before I go. I hope I ain't got nothing out there in my walker getting wet. That shouldn't be wet. What I do with my screwdriver that I was not that one. Is this the other one? There come the thunder. My baby's gonna be freaking out now. That gun at Dauber, you carried too long, buddy. You waited too long. He may even come running out here. He may even come running out here. It's not the thunder or the lightning that scares him. What scares him is if the lights flash. Or go off. 
That freaked him out. Why, I don't know. I might wind up having to grind some of these screws off, but I want this piece of balloon to clean. Got that all. Most of my screwdrivers have lost their magnetism, or most of it. So I need to magnetize them things again. And if you don't know how, I'm going to show you. I'll show you how to magnetize your screwdriver if you ain't got enough magnetism to them. A lot of people already know it, but some of you don't. For those of you who don't, I'm going to show you. And I've been knowing this slacking off. I might better give it a run to get in the house. <laughs> you know the other day I was over at Publix and it, I got caught out in the rain and I had my hat on my camera going and everything and this lady seen me going your camera's gonna get wet. Your camera's gonna get wet. She's running over there with an umbrella. I said, it's all right, it's waterproof. <laughs> she said, impossible. I said, no, it can go underwater even. It don't hurt it. I've never put it underwater because I really don't trust it to go under. I, 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 don't, I ain't lost nothing under the water. Nice chunk of aluminum. GoPro, stop recording. <laughs>